Okay, um, this video is going to be about formula feeding, and um, I just wanted to do a tag video, or start a series of a tag video, um, about what kind of formula does your baby drink, and why do you use that specific kind of formula. Um, I use soy formula, um, the Similac soy formula, and um, it is milk-free, lactose-free, um, for fussiness, gas, and spit up. Just read that directly from the can. Uh, but anyways, I use it because it's the only formula that my daughter will take. And um, I tried the Similac, just basically the Vance Shield, the one that comes in the blue can, because that was just you know, the regular old formula. And I didn't think you know that would cause her any problems because you know um, she hasn't really had very many problems. She's had some, I think she had some gas early on, but that, that's kind of common in um, babies when they're young. So anyways, but... Um, she would not take that formula. So I switched to soy, which was the other can, the free can that I got. And um, that has worked perfectly for her. My aunt actually, when she breastfed her baby, um, she breastfed until she was eight months old. And she tried formulas, different formulas, and she had to go to the soy. So, and my cousin liked the soy. I don't know what it is about breastfed babies and liking soy milk, but our soy formula. But um, basically, um, I looked up a few reasons to use soy formula. Um, I don't really know a lot about soy formula other than that, you know, it's for milk allergies and, and different things like that. And um, um, this website's just saying that uh, the indications for soy uh, protein based formulas include like preference for vegetarian diet or infants with a lactose um, deficiency. Um, also, it just it tells you know it says like um, when when the baby has colic a lot of parents will use soy formula because they have gas and it's you know specifically for fussiness and gas and spit up um anyways it says if your infant gets formula as a supplement to breast milk the AAP states that soy formula has no advantage over um, cow's milk formula formula or cow's milk based formula unless the baby has one of the indications stated earlier um but just like i said my baby will only take soy formula so <laughs> also um it says that uh between 20 and 25 percent of formulas sold in the u.s are soy based so and then also, it's also was talking about trying to find it. Should have been a little more prepared. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it says soy based formulas are not recommended, or soy protein based formulas are not recommended for babies born prematurely. Um, cow's milk based formulas designed for preterm babies are superior, is what it says. Um, and I'm just reading this stuff off the website, I'm not trying to give any medical advice to anyone. Definitely ask your pediatrician about what formula you should use. Um, I did not, because my pediatrician right now does not know that I am um, supplementing with formula, even though I, well, I kind of told her that I was going to do it around this time. And um, she didn't reckon it, recommend any specific kind of formula, but um, I told her I'd probably be doing it you know, doing the formula when she was nine months old, and she said that was fine. Um, anyways, I mean, she was just amazed that at six months, at my six month appointment, that I was still doing formula. I mean, not formula, breast milk. <laughs> um, and I, and I work, so or I work night shift. So she was just like really amazed at that. But um, I wanted to give my baby the the best until you know nine months. Um, so anyways, back to the point of the video. <laughs> uh, also, <clears throat> excuse me, I think that's really it. Also, there's an interesting thing that um, they did some research and it says that eating soy um, there's no conclusive evidence that it causes any problems to human development, reproduction, or endocrine function. 
anyways but just a little blip of that and this was from WebMD I will post the link to this website in the little information box as well and um, but you can, if you just type in soy um, formula you get a lot of results um, waiting for the website to load but um, just like I said only formula she'll take I don't know why but she likes this formula so that's what I'm sticking with um, and also the other reason that I'm, I'm turning to formulas because my supply has, is starting to decrease slowly. Over the past two months, I have lost about, oh, I think about five ounces total. I went from producing about 12 to 13 ounces to only seven to eight. So I've got frozen, but it's not gonna last forever. <laughs> um, it's, you know, I don't have a supply enough for three months. I have a supply enough for like a month. Um, Anyways, it says usually, this this website says that usually parents choose soy formula when their baby is sensitive or allergic to cow's milk protein or trouble digesting lactose or milk sugar, which basically that says on the can that it's easy to digest, milk free, lactose free, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> and uh, anyways, but I think that's really it for my video. If you guys have any questions or any comments, or want to do a video, I'd love to hear you guys' uh, formula feeding videos about what kind of formula you use and why. Um, just uh, do a tag. Thanks for watching.